everyone and welcome to no that's wrong hey there yarn lovers nope that's not it hello my yarny axe no nope, wrong hi guys it's welcome back to yarn no hello my beautiful no hello my yarny friends no nope. Good morning, Yarnabees. That's it. <laughs> Can you tell I have been sick? Yes, I, I'm, I'm sounding a lot better though. I think I'm coming out the other side of this cold. Yeah. So, cheers to me. <clears throat> um, huh, I feel like I haven't been around for quite a while. And, um, yeah, I've been watching a whole bunch of videos, but, uh, haven't done a whole lot of commenting. I've just been feeling like crap. And <clears throat> I, uh, like I said, today I'm actually not feeling too bad. So, yay! <laughs> I still weigh as a ghost though. <clears throat> um, so how's the, uh. COVID-19 treating all of you. It's been rough here. It's It's been really rough here. Um, George isn't working near as much as he should be. Uh, everything's shutting down. It's like the zombie apocalypse has hit. I just, I don't know. I don't know how everybody's going to fare out of this. It's, uh, it's crazy. It's crazy. So I hope that all of you are doing okay. And I'm really feeling um, the strain of, of worry. But the good side is we all get to stay home and crochet. Yay! Like we don't do that already. <laughs> so anyways, um, guess what I'm going to do? Don't tell anybody. I'm going on a yarn ban. God help me. I really don't have a choice. Like we just, we can't afford to, to be spending outside of our means right now. Right? Because <clears throat> there's just not, the money's not coming in. And um, with everybody shutting down everything, and I don't even know if Michael's is open, to be honest. <laughs> so, but Amazon is. <laughs> but now I don't even know if we can get our packages delivered because, you know, they're shutting everything down. So I'm sure that there's probably some delivery people out there still. So good on them. Um... What else? Uh, oh, my finger. Remember I was telling you how, how my finger hurts so bad and sometimes I can't bend it and whatever. I was talking to Sandy from Left is Right Crochet and she made a really good point. She thinks I have trigger finger. I'm going, that makes all the sense in the world. Totally makes sense. Yes, trigger finger. I think that she's probably right. It it feels like it's trigger finger. You now, so not sure what I can do about that. <clears throat> Just going to kind of live with it for now because there is no way in hell I'm going into a doctor's office right now. Not with all this craziness that's going on. Man, you're up way too high right now. Hang on. Oh, did that work? No, it didn't work. Oh, well, anyway. Um, have you guys seen the patterns out there for the COVID-19 germ? The plushy toys, like, I, <laughs> man, I went on this one feed on a Facebook group and this girl was promoting her uh, pattern. <clears throat> It was cute. It was really cute little thing. P 
people went bananas on both sides of the argument. Some people were furious um, that they were promoting this as being a cute, fun little toy or whatever. Then there was the other side of it where they were saying that this is a great learning tool for kids, you know, and for sensory um, and stuff and, and all that. And I was just like, wow, I like I'm watching this feed and I was just going, hmm, I don't know how to feel about it. You know, um, <laughs> I, I just don't know. I, I'm angry that this is all happening. Um, but it is happening and we have to deal with it and people deal with it in different ways. And, um, you know, it's a pattern, right? It's like, I don't know. I don't know. Don't know. So what are your thoughts? Would Leave a comment down below and tell me what you think of all of that. Something, uh, speaking of patterns, <laughs> something I wanted to uh, touch base on because of the new people that have joined my group. Hi! My, my YouTube channel and all my craziness. Um, is that down below in the description box, I have all my links for my Facebook page and my Etsy shop. I do have an Etsy shop with patterns in it. Um, I have uh, a Teespring shop where you can get some mugs and bags and stuff that I've designed. Uh, I have, what else do I have down there? Um, oh, I've got my favorite things on Amazon. Uh, and then of course I have my, um, my sister's uh, GoFundMe page. So... <clears throat> So, I, I mean, as you guys know, my sister is still very ill. She just had her fourth brain surgery and had the permanent stint put in. I'm not going to keep posting uh, updates on my sister for now because she's so up and down all the time. The minute that I come on here and say, yay, she's doing really good, the next day she tanks. Um, so... <sighs> It's just it it's just like this. It's a roller coaster ride, and um, so I'm not going to subject you guys to that. If anything major happens, then I will let you guys know. Uh, <clears throat> so anyway, so that's that. So yeah, so go check out my Etsy page. I'm actually thinking because of this whole um, apocalyptic disaster that's happening right now I'm thinking about doing a, a percentage off on my patterns I have to figure out how to do that on Etsy <laughs> but once I figure that out I will let you guys know and uh, yeah so I have been crocheting like a mad woman I'm sure all of you are too but made another one <laughs> So I made this uh, this cardigan. It's actually it's it's a really pretty blue and a purple. It's kind of hard to see. I don't know if I can if this will help at all. I don't have my light on. That's probably why. Um, but it's a it's a really pretty blue and it's a really pretty purple. Let me turn the light on. See if that helps. It helped a little bit. Okay, so. Um, this was made out of Bernat uh, Premium, Premium, Premier. Yeah, <laughs> that stuff. Um, and it's a three-quarter sleeve. It's not a full sleeve, so it comes down to just above the um, the elbow. So, and then I made. See how smart that was? <laughs> then I made a um, a little vest. Now, this was supposed to be a little bit bigger than it is. <laughs> but I got tired of crocheting, so I made it smaller. It's actually a size small. But, uh, 
yeah, it's just a, a little vest that I made. It's the back of it is longer than it's like down a lot further and it's a granny square. So yeah. So there's that. I made that. Then I made some hats and stuff like that. Now I'm doing something that I don't normally do. I am in the process, oops, that's wrong, in the process of making a baby sweater. So that's the one half. I'm working on the other half right now. So yeah, I'm making a little baby cardigan. And I'm making it out of, whoops, Karen Latte, of course. And this colorway is Minyard Vineyard. Min, min, Minyard Vineyard. Oh, jeez. <laughs> what is a Minyard? <laughs> wow. Okay, I think I need some more of this. Ah, Mineral Vineyard. There we go. <laughs> wow. Okay. Yeah. So yeah, I'm I'm doing that. I'm not too sure how how I'm gonna do the collar on it yet though. Kind of flying by the seat of my pants. And uh, oh, guess what I got in the mail today? I am so happy with this. I got a Jane Wynn bag I I bought this um, oh, oh there you go ah, we all know Jane uh, I did this as part of the Charlie's Angels um, uh, not Charlie's Angels she had a bag I can't talk you guys I'm sorry <laughs> She had a bag sale for Charlie from uh, Have a Yarn with Charlie, just like she did for my sister. And I had to get in on it. So I actually missed the sale. And I asked her if she could make me a certain bag. Uh, and I would just have the proceeds go to Charlie. So she said, sure. <laughs> so look what I got, guys. I am loving this bag. I just... Oh, I, I'm absolutely in love with this bag. Isn't it gorgeous? Look at all the animals. And then there's this side. It's like, oh, look at all the animals. Oh, man. It just, oh, the colors are amazing. Amazing. And then she put the green on the inside. And then she's got her little tag there and it's a box bottom and I'm just it's it's heavy duty it's a thick bag and it's uh, I mean there's no way anything's gonna happen to this bag it is sturdy so I I mean I I've gotten bags from a few people and Ella from No Catchy Name, I've gotten bags from her, I've gotten Billy bags, right? Gotta support everybody, right? Um, and, but this is the first Jane bag I've gotten, and I have to say, I am in love with it. Absolutely in love with it. This this print, I mean, look at this, look at this monkey. <laughs> you know, I mean, this print is just, ah. Uh, it makes me smile. It really makes me smile. So, and then she gave me, oops. Um, she gave me a little bell stitch marker. <laughs> um, so thank you so much, Jane, for doing that for me. Uh, I'm gonna get so much use out of this bag. It's not even funny. So, gosh. 
I'm I'm starting I'm I'm becoming Laura right, from Mad Mimi's man. She's got like a gazillion bags, but she has whips in every one of her bags. I don't know how that woman does so many whips. I I I just don't even know. But uh, did you, have you been watching her videos? <laughs> Oh man, I thought I was gonna pee my pants when she did the um, season of the granny. She just posted a video, and she did granny pants. <laughs> I I have no words. I have no words. I. <laughs> Oh man, um, only she would do something like this. I swear, like she, she's a hoot. She's a hoot. She takes things like beyond, beyond. <laughs> I, wow. <laughs> I would not be wanting to go into that woman's brain. And I just, I, I'd probably never come out. <laughs> Oh man. Anyway, so go check her out. I'll leave her link down below because man, that was funny shit right there. That was, <laughs> that was good. And of course I'm trying not to laugh and I'm coughing and hacking and laughing and crying. And I was just like, oh geez. So I needed that good laugh. <clears throat> so, and her chicks, oh, they are so adorable. So adorable. I fell in love with all of them. They just, oh, mm -hmm. so I ended up um, taking some screenshots and there was one screenshot where she was kissing one of them. I thought it was hilarious. It was so cute. I'm going to put that here. <laughs> so I would have laughed if he had just gone, and <laughs> just bit her. That would have been funny. So anyway, um, okay, so I'm starting to lose my voice again. Uh, I don't know if I've got anything else to talk about. I'm, uh, once I've finished this baby blanket, then I'm going to do some more hats for the Hat Not Hate. Um, I do have lots of hat tutorials in my Etsy shop if you're interested in um, using that for your Hat Not Hate. Oh, I did order from Lion Brand. I did order some Hat Not Hate labels, uh, the little wooden tags. I'm just waiting for those to show up. Um, what else? Bailey. Wow. <laughs> did you hear that? I just mentioned her name and at the same time she barked. That was freaky. Okay. Anyways, Bailey got her bark box today. She gets one every month. And it has like two plushy toys in it, two bags of treats, and uh, one hard treat. Uh, like it's like a hard stick treat. And every time the courier comes with that bark box, she knows. <laughs> and she just runs out the door after this poor woman. <laughs> and she's just like, give me my box, give me my box. <laughs> it's just hilarious. So, um, yeah, so she got one today and she's all happy and she's full now because she, she had her treats. And now she's having a nap. <laughs> so, but anyway, I just, like I said, I just wanted to touch base with you guys and uh, say I'm still here. I'm just, you know, trying to chillax a little bit. Um, having George at home, stressing out all the time is not easy. Driving me crazy. So I really hope that this, this COVID-19 thing just kind of goes on its merry way somewhere and dies. Just, I just want it gone. I want it done over with, as I'm sure we all do, because this is just craziness. I'm just waiting for the zombies to pop out somewhere. Like nuts. So anyway, okay. So I guess that's it. Uh, I will have more to show you guys on my next video. I have a couple things that I really want to make. Um, 
one of which is something similar to, I don't know if you guys are going to see this. See that? See that little guy? Yeah. I'm going to try and make some of those. So, wish me luck. It's a granny square kind of thing, so it shouldn't be that hard, right? <laughs> yeah, I guess we'll see. Okay, I'm going to talk to you guys later. And uh, stay safe. Okay, I love you all very, very, very much. And uh, talk to you soon. Oh, I guess I'm not allowed to do that anymore, am I? Okay, like arm bump. How about arm bump? Can't even do fist pumps anymore, I don't think. Oh, there's that foot thing. No, that'll hurt my foot. So, I don't know what to do anymore. Okay, see you guys later. Bye. Yep, go stay. Yeah, okay, no kissing. <laughs>